Gamer here and today I'm taking a look at Mr. Gaming Watch Colored Screen. Uh, this is just recently came out. This is a uh, old look at a Mr. Gaming Watch little handheld, not the flip one, just a regular standalone one. It has uh, Mr. Gamer Watch, a ball juggling game, and two other games. So as you can see on the package, you have uh, it says Mr. Game & Watch, everything else, but it also says Super Mario Brothers, because this comes with Super Mario Brothers 1 and Super Mario Brothers 2, The Lost Level. Uh, Super Mario Brothers 2, The Lost Level was actually regular Super Mario Brothers 2 in Japan, but unfortunately for us, we got Super Mario Brothers 2, which was actually a reskin of a game called Doki Doki Panic, and they thought that Super Mario Brothers 2, The Lost Level, was too hard, so and the Super Mario Bros. All-Star package that came with, uh, that was in the Super Nintendo, that came with all three of the games, plus it came with this one, Super Mario Bros. The Lost Levels, which we've later found out was Super Mario Bros. 2, and that whole thing. But, as you can see, you get a nice little look at the, uh, nice little package of, uh, World 1-1, everything else, the clouds, the Goomba, the blocks, the pipe, the trees, everything else. And you got a nice little look at the out screen. If you turn it around, you get a look at what games you're getting. And you get a nice little outlook of the boss fight between Bowser. Which the good thing is about this is that uh, if you didn't want this cover, you wanted to just have it as original, just to stick out, you can take the screen off, you can take the slider off, and there you go. The slider. The back of it is still has the print of all, all four things that are all four modes of the game. So without further ado, let's get into it. Get into it. It has a nice little pull tab here so you can pull it out easily. Get a little charging cable with it. bit of instructions on the modes and how to switch it. Turn it on to game mode. First, you have to turn it on. It's right there with the charge button. And as you see, I already set the time. You could switch to game mode, which has all three games. You have the time mode, just to switch it back to the time. You could switch the times to different little screens. You had a nice little uh, pause and select button, the A and B, and the joystick, with the D-pad. So, let's just take a look at a couple of games. Okay, so let's do the original. See, I paused it from, when I shut it off, it re-picked back up from right where I left off. Uh, you can set the volume, you can set the color, you can reset the game, so let's reset it. No different runs very smoothly. Very 
difficult to do this with. Again, we're going to but, uh, let's choose another, let's choose the last game. Super Mario Brothers edition. Uh, very nice piece, very very well put together. Only thing I have a little tiny gripe with is that it doesn't come with a display stand. So like if you see the watch is going, uh, I can't really put it like on a little coffee table or anything like that to display. I have to like go to 3D print or try and find something else that's small enough to put as a display stand. But uh, besides that, it's actually very nice. Very small thing even though nowadays everyone already can get this on their phone or three of them I mean it is very nice to have a you know look back because after all finding these things are very very hard so uh, very well done uh, if you have any questions or you want me to take a look at anything else please write in the comments uh, please like and subscribe and thanks for watching have a great day